Well, I just wanted to give a very, very quick rundown of, of this boy over here, which is the GT Omega Inertia, which uh, GT Omega have had me sent over and just arrived this morning. And I fitted it away from my old RS9, which is now retired. So uh, this is it, it's all fitted, not too shabby. You just take out the four bolts here at the bottom, one on each side. It's a very, very nicely put together kit. It's this sort of, it's material. It's sort of felty feeling. I mean, nice bit of embroidery with the GT Omega stuff here. A lovely sticker for Bongo Racing, never too old to race. Uh, and then a little embroidery here on each side. These are little removable pieces with Velcro on them. Not sure if they can be washed or not. We have the, the slide back forward and this little kit comes with it. That's already fitted on. I have this in the middle one, it was in the bottom one, so that's angling it back just a tad. I'm uh, using the same runners from my original seat. I had to uh, slide these over just a little bit because it's slightly wider than the RS9, but very firm steel chassis in this boyo. I, I think it actually looks quite swimmingly well with my kit. The Lady in Red looks lovely. There's my rig now. I very, very swish. There we go. I'm in the big red chair. So far, so good. So we're doing a full day of racing tomorrow. So we'll see how we get on. But so far, I'm really snug, really lovely. Nicely built. Thank you, G2 Omega. Wow, loving it. Then he waddled away.